In this video, I'm going to be playing Toilet Tower Defense on a brand new account for 100 hours. Now, if you guys haven't watched the first 50 hours, I highly recommend going back and watching the first 50 hours of this series. But if you don't want to, here's my current progress in the series. So as you can see here, if I go to the units, I have a green laser cameraman, two godly titan present men, a Sans TV man, a laser gun cameraman, a frost DJ speaker man, a ninja cameraman, a medic cameraman. Now, our goal by the end of this episode is to get an upgraded titan cinnamon man, as you can see from up here. And let me tell you, I've got a brand new method to get a bunch of coins every single day without spending a single bit of robot so make sure to stay tuned to see what method it is but without further ado let's start on hour 50. so immediately what i'm going to say to you guys is that the toilet hq map got changed so it's obviously not the best map anymore and apparently according to you guys in the comments the palm paradise map is actually the best map so we're going to go ahead and test that theory in a nightmare run and apparently the frost dj speaker man got nerfed again even though it didn't need a third nerf but wait what happened there why did i get teleported back to spawn but yeah, I was saying this got nerfed again, and now his DPS is only 4,000 instead of 6,000. It doesn't want to teleport us to Palm Paradise. What? What is happening, bro? Oh, there we go. Finally. Okay, let me do nightmare mode. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to place the green laser cameraman right here for slowing. And he should take out the early game units, so it's fine. And now my goal from here is just to place three Santa TV men and then place a Frost DJ speaker man. Because I know in the last update, the Frost DJ speaker man was able to solo nightmare, but I'm not sure if it still can do that. So there's only one way to find out. Okay, there we go. Our first Santa TV man is down. And we can place our second one. There we go. Now we need one more and then we can start placing the Frost DJ speaker man. And there we go. The third one's down. Okay, before I place one of these Frost DJ speaker men, I think I'm just just gonna upgrade the green laser cameraman once now he's dealing more damage and shooting a lot faster all right so straight off the bat i'm gonna place the frost dj speaker man right here there we go he's taking out this claw toilet and boom there we go we can upgrade him for the first time they've nerfed this guy so hard though and he's still super overpowered if you guys watched the last episode you guys would know that i was literally soloing nightmare with only the frost dj speaker man which is kind of crazy if you think about it okay hopefully the boss toilet can get taken out yeah they're gonna get taken out and i could upgrade the frost dj speaker man again there we go and i think i'm gonna upgrade the green laser cameraman again so he's shooting a little bit faster. I want to upgrade some Santa TV men as well. There we go. One of them's level three. The game's lagging quite hard right now. I don't know why. Okay, there we go. All three of the Santa TV men are now level three. And we can upgrade the Frost DJ speaker man again. Now it has a lot more range than it did before. And I kind of want to place another one right now. Right here. Wait, I don't have enough money. There we go. I have enough money. And I think I can upgrade him once as well. Boom. There we go. One upgrade and two upgrades. There we go. Level three Frost DJ speaker man. Another level four Frost DJ speaker man right here. Okay, I'm going to upgrade all of these Santa TV men. There we go. Every single single one of them are now level four i know auto skipping on nightmare is a pretty fast way to get coins but trust me in this video i'm going to show you guys a much faster way to get coins and i can almost guarantee of summoning a gold leaf this video so make sure to stay tuned oh wait i forgot we had the titan present man oh we can place this thing down i forgot about this guy and i also forgot about my sans tv men what am i doing bro okay there we go we can upgrade the titan present man once okay there we go one of our sans tv men are fully maxed and we can max another one come on we got one more to max there we go now all of our sans tv men are maxed which means we can focus on placing more of our units. Uh oh, the security guard toilet is making it kind of far. But obviously not far enough. Okay, there we go. We can max our Titan present man. There we go. And now he's got a damage of 9,975. Okay, so we're on wave 50. And it's looking pretty good, to be fair. We've just placed our third Titan present man. And we've nearly fully maxed him. Oh, no, we have fully maxed him. I didn't even realize. But the giant smooth toilet is going to get absolutely taken out by our Titan present men. And there's a lot of gold presents I can see going in right here. So, okay, the giant smooth toilet is about to die. Come on. Die already. Come on, man. And there we go. One match. 600 coins. But I am going to go ahead and I'm going to play again and do the exact same method as last time. So, yeah, as I said, I've done the exact same method to get another 600 coins. Boom. There we go. 600 coins just like that. And now we're going to go back to the lobby and we're going to spend all the coins that we just got from them two rounds. So, I'm just going to go over here, auto sell everything except for legendary and 710. And we did not get anything good. But we're just going to summon in one. So, we've got camera woman, a cameraman. Come on. Give me a legendary summon. Camera woman. Come on. Cameraman, please give me something good on the last one. And a cameraman. We didn't get anything good. But what I kind of want to do is because we have two Titan present, man. I kind of want to trade one in the trading plaza. Oh, wait. We got a package from Rainbow Lollipop. Please sign your main account. Um, I don't even have partner on my main account. So should I take it or decline it? Okay, I'm just going to decline it because he wanted me to sign it, obviously. Which means he wanted it back. So there we go. Reject it. Okay, so now that we're in the trading plaza, I'm going to say in the chat right here. Trading new godly. There we go. And I'm 
I'm just gonna say it once because on my main account I got banned for spamming it. Okay, I'm just gonna send trace to everyone in the server and see what they can offer for my Titan present man. Oh, a glitch camera man. I don't think that's worth as much as our Titan present man though. I'm trying to get an overpay, so I'm not gonna do the glitch camera man, but it was a pretty good offer. Let's see if this guy can offer for our Titan present man right here. This guy's trading us the mace camera man. Oh, wait, that's worth more than our godly. Oh, and he's adding 100 gems. Can you add any unit? Question mark with the mace. I think I'll do this. Okay, I think this is a W offer. He's changing his offer. 100 gems. Come on, man. Okay, this guy is kind of being annoying. So I'm just going to skip his offer right here. And we can find another better offer. Hey, um, Sigma is what this guy just said. Oh, wait. This guy's offering a shield camera, man. Yes. We want that. We want that. Yes. Oh, he just, he just declined on us, bro. There's no way. Oh, wait. This guy's giving a good offer. Oh, no way. We just got... All... Nah. Okay. Yeah, he just, he just edged us. Wait, no way. We got this. Large laser camera... No, bro. They keep... it. Please don't decline. Please don't decline. Please. No way. Yes. Oh my God. That was such a W trade. Oh my God. Finally, we got a good trade. No way. That took way too long, bro. That took like a whole hour to try and get a trade like that. Bro, finally, we got a large laser camera, man. Okay, before I trade this thing again, I kind of want to test him in a nightmare run to see how good he actually is. Because apparently this guy is actually pretty good. So I'm going to go onto the best map, Palm Paradise. And we're going to vote nightmare mode. Okay, so what I'm going to do here, I'm going to place the large laser camera, man, right here. And we're going to see how good he actually is. And we can actually get his first upgrade. Oh, he's doing a lot of damage. What? His cooldown can go down to 0.1, which is absolutely crazy. Yeah, so we got two of these large laser cameramen down right now. And these guys are pretty OP. They do 14,000 damage per second. As you can see, the security guard toilet got absolutely wiped right then. Okay, these large laser cameramen are actually pretty good. As you can see, they're draining all the toilet's HP. Uh-oh, a lot of these guys are making it past. Okay, so I'm going to sell my Frost DJ speaker men at the front. And I want to place large laser cameramen over here because these guys are super overpowered. There's not a chance MJ makes it past here. Look at his health getting absolutely drained. Yeah, there is no chance. And I'm going to place a green laser just to be sure. Yep, three, two, one. And the boss is dead and the massive buzzsaw oven toilet is about to die as well and there we go he's gone but i do kind of want to trade this large laser cameraman right here because i don't know i don't think it's too useful for our team because the, like the optimal team is to have a green laser cameraman frosty j speaker man and then a titan or an upgraded titan and then a medic and obviously money unit so i'm going to go back to the lobby and i'm going to go back to the trading plaza to trade this unit so i tried trading this unit and i didn't really end up getting any good offers so i went back to going to do rounds okay guys so i want to go ahead and do another nightmare round because obviously we failed to trade this large laser cameraman but i think we're gonna go ahead and do it in why not try a toilet city you can never go wrong with toilet city so i don't know how good the toilet city map is but i think we're just gonna do the same thing as we always do okay so we've done this round as usual and the win was pretty easy to get here even though we didn't have a titan unit and everyone's going on about how frosty j speaker man got nerfed but he didn't get nerfed that much okay so this round is kind of sloppy if you can see a lot of these toilets have made it kind of far but i think we could win this hopefully we can what I might do is place a lot of um, large laser cameramen because they do quite a lot of damage. So there we go. He's doing quite a bit of damage. Yeah, we definitely got this, bro. It's not even going to be close. Okay, dual claw laser toilet's about to die. Oh, the giant smooth toilet's getting absolutely drained right here. Come on, die already. Die. Come on, man. And there we go. We just won nightmare mode. Now, I'm going to go back to the lobby and obviously this map was nowhere near as good as Palm Paradise. But we do have 1,243 coins, which means we can spend a bunch of these coins on getting some units. Come on, give me something good. Please, and we literally got only trash. Are you joking, bro? Okay, now that we've spent all of our coins, I kind of want to go and try to trade this large laser cameraman right here to try and get some, maybe a Titan unit or something. Because that is literally what I need right now. And I saw a lot of you guys in the last episode were saying I should have taken the Sinister Titan TV man. I know, I'm dumb. I'm not the best at trading, okay? Okay, I sat there trading for a while until I found a super good offer that someone was willing to give. Okay, wait, this guy's given us a really good offer. So he's given us a ghost cameraman and a TV woman. So the ghost cameraman is literally worth more than my unit on its own. So this is actually a super good offer. There we go, boom. Ghost cameraman, that can actually act as our titan. I just realized that actually could. So what we're going to do now, we're going to go into a round and we're going to test this unit right here. Apparently this unit is super good, so... Okay, so I played this round normally until I had enough to buy the ghost cameraman. And let me tell you, this thing was absolutely overpowered. Okay, guys, as you can see right here, we have a ghost cameraman right here who's level 3. And he's doing 10,000 damage with a cooldown of 0 0.8 seconds, which is absolutely crazy. And we can upgrade him again. So now he has a cooldown of 0 0.6 and he's doing 12,000 damage, which is crazy. And I think in around 2 
two upgrades, he'll be fully mad. Now he's doing 24,000 damage. He has a range of 25 and a cooldown of 0.4, which is absolutely crazy because I think his DPS is around 60,000, which is really good for an exclusive unit. Now, right here in this situation, I don't think there's anything better but to place another one of these guys. So I'm going to place him right in front here. There we go. And I don't think this guy can get stunned either. So that's a good thing about this unit. And there we go. He's level five. We've got one more upgrade to go through. Okay, there we go. We can fully max our second ghost cameraman right here. There we go. This unit is making these rounds super easy because they do so much damage. As you guys can see right here, the ghost cameramen are absolutely destroying this move toilet right now. Look at this. That was so easy, bro. What? Okay, I think I'm going to go into another round and do the exact same method as what I just did right there because that was absolutely overpowered. Okay, so we used the exact same method on this round and for some reason it got a little sloppy closer to the end and it was a lot more difficult for us to beat. But we did end up beating it in the end. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to the lobby and I'm going to spend all the coins that I just got from that, which I think should be another 1,200. Yeah, there we go. 1,218. Hopefully we can get something good this time. More auto sell on. Please give me something good. And we got trash again, bro. Right, someone won TV man. Woman. Camera woman. Come on, please give me something good. And cameraman. Nothing good. Wait, no way this guy's accepting this. A TV woman for a shield cameraman. That's worth it, right? Yeah, that was super worth it. What? The TV woman's only worth 300 gems. And the shield cameraman's worth 1,000. That was such a win. What? How did we manage to get that trade, bro? Well, that was just another W trade. And we weren't even in the trading plaza, which is absolutely crazy. So now I think it is time to show you guys the secret method that I've been hiding this whole video. Now, you might be wondering at first, why, why does the mic sound different? I ended up fixing my mic earlier on today. Don't worry. It's not a new mic. It just sounds a little bit better than the other one. And I might be a little bit more laggy than usual. And this right here will explain why. And look at this. We got four extra accounts sitting here on my computer, plus my fifth account, which is literally the max amount of people you can get into a game. As you can see, zero out of five. Now, my method, and if you didn't watch the last video, I made a macro so where it could auto lose and auto skip overnight. And I would get around 40 coins per round. But now that I have five accounts, 40 times five is 200. But not only that, I also get a friend boost of 1.65, which goes up to around 320 per round, which is every three or four minutes. So if every three or four minutes, I'm just going to say three minutes 30. If I'm getting 320 coins every three minutes, so in an hour, how many three minutes 30 there is? 11.142, whatever that number is. And now I times that by eight because I normally get eight hours of sleep. 137, now I times that by 320. And this is the amount of coins I should get overnight, hopefully. So without further ado, let's get into the AFK. Okay, so here I went AFK for eight hours with this macro on with all of my accounts. And as you can see, I'm generating so much coins. Okay, guys, so from that overnight, every single account got 7,500 coins, which in total adds up to 37,500 coins. I'm not on the actual account. I'm on the fourth account right now. And we're going to spend all the coins on this account first. And then we're going to go to the next account and then the next account and so on. So I'm going to go to auto skill sell. I'm going to sell everything except for legendary and summon 10. And we got trash. Trash, 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 trash. Come on, we got two more summons. Trash, come on, give me something good. And trash, we got absolutely nothing from that. But let's go ahead and go on to the second account. And here we are on our next account, and we have 7,581 coins again. We're going to auto sell everything except for legendary and summon 10. I mean, we got two large TV, man. That's not that bad. Summon 10. Trash, trash again, trash again, trash again. Come on, give me at least one legendary. Trash again, two large TV men, trash again. Come on, bro. And we literally just got trash, bro. Are you serious? Okay, let's go ahead and go on to the third account. Okay, here we are on our third account, and we have the same amount of coins as all the other accounts. And we're gonna go over here to the main crate, auto sell everything except for legendary, and summon 10. And we got trash, 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 trash. There we go. Finally, we got a legendary, bro. That took like, what, 15,000 coins? More than 15,000 coins. That took like 20,000 coins to get. That was awful. Okay, let's go ahead and summon 10 again. We got trash, trash again, and trash again. Okay, so what I'm gonna do with this dark speaker man, I'm gonna post it to the main alt account. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here to the post office, dark speaker man, skibbity toilet, sigma underscore K, send and confirm. There we go. And now let's move on to the next account. Okay, so here we are on our fourth account. We're gonna go over here, turn auto sell on like always. Hopefully we can get something good. Got Trash here, trash, 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 trash. Bro, what is my luck? It's so awful right now. Trash, 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 
and trash, bro. There's no way. We spent like 30,000 coins and we've gotten like nothing. We got one legendary. Okay, this is the last account we can summon on. Please give me something good from the summon units. Auto sell everything. Summon 10. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, bro. We've got the large laser cameraman. Let's go. Finally, bro. I thought we were actually just going to get nothing. Finally, man. Okay, let's go ahead and summon again. We've got trash, 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 trash. Two legendaries. Why is this account so much more lucky than the other accounts? What? Trash, trash, and trash. But that doesn't even matter because we actually got a large laser cameraman and two legendaries. Okay, I'm going to go over to the post office and I'm going to claim what I just gave myself on the other account. There we go. Dark speaker man. And now we have dark, three dark speaker men and a large laser cameraman. Okay, guys, so I went AFK again for another nine hours after this, but I'm not going to spend the coins just yet. That'll be for later. Here we are. We're only a few updates later. We're now in this episode 71 update, so a lot has happened since I've last recorded for this video. We've got the marketplace. We've got the post office. We literally got so much new things that we can actually make a bunch of profit off of. So our inventory right now, large laser cameraman, shield cameraman, green laser cameraman, and ghost cameraman. That's basically all that matters, but we do have the red laser cameraman in the summoning right now. Oh, wait, I might actually try summon for that right now because people are overpricing that thing like crazy and i could probably get my hands on one of them and sell them for quite high all uh, right no I'm, I'm gonna try it i'm gonna try it i'm gonna try it do i have any boost oh, i don't even have any boost all right give me it okay just commons and basics are you kidding me bro i just want this i want this red laser cameraman they're gonna absolutely overprice it okay we got the dual bat speaker man come on i just want the mythic give me the mythic give me it they're gonna overprice this stuff so hard i right, no, i didn't get it okay i'm gonna go ahead and try on my other accounts but i'm gonna skip through all of it until i actually get something good so you guys won't have to watch me open everything that nope, we didn't get it rip okay i didn't get anything but on the alt accounts i gifted myself everything that i got through the post office so hopefully i didn't type in the wrong name and i got them all yeah there we go six things that we can claim it select 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 and there we go 180 gems we have now, and we have a bunch of dual bat speaker men. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and go to the trading plaza and try sell some stuff on the marketplace and buy some stuff on the marketplace. There we go. Now, let me see how much my legendary actually is worth. This person's selling it for 16. Okay, apparently it's worth 40. So I'm going to go ahead and... Hmm, I'm not going to buy that guy's one, but I'm going to go ahead and um, sell a bunch of these for 25. There we go. Dark speaker man can go up for... This can go up for 15. Why not? And right here, my large laser cameraman can go up for... It can go up for 300, but the lowest price right now is 205. So I'm going to try to put it to 250. And the shield cameraman can actually go up for 150 right here. There we go. And now we can go ahead and try some. Uh, try to buy some stuff. What could I get? Okay, I'll see you guys when someone actually buys something of mine. People are buying my dark speaker men. There's no way. I think someone just bought all of my dark speaker men for 15 gems each. Let's go. I didn't need them guys either way. Okay, guys. I've decided to buy this announcer cameraman right here for 49 gems because apparently it's worth 100. I'm going to go ahead and resell this for like 75 maybe. That'll work. Oh, wait. Someone bought something. Oh, my large laser cameraman got bought. Finally. Let's go. We got 500 gems for that. And now we can go on to buy something even more overpowered. So we sold this large laser cameraman for 244. Hmm, maybe I can find one for lower. Okay, I think I found what I'm going to buy here. I'm going to buy a toxic upgraded targeting cameraman for 300 gems. There we go. But, and now we're going to resell that for 250. No, not 250. 350. Actually, 375. Someone just bought my dual bat speaker man for 25 gems. That's pretty good. But we're still trying to sell our toxic right here. Oh, wait. Someone's selling it for 350. I might have to switch servers. Something got bought. I don't know what it was, though. It was... Oh, it was one of my toxics. That's good. Now we have 370 gems, so we can try to snipe something from the marketplace. Oh, would you look at that? Another one of our toxics got sold. Let's go. We've made so much profit already. Okay, this guy's selling the Titan cinema man for 90 so i'm gonna go ahead and buy it and sell it for 105 105 is a good price okay so we've been doing this for two hours now and we're on 605 gems and we're still trying to sell two of our dual bat speaker men but i think i want to buy an overpowered unit so then we can actually do some runs there we go someone bought my titan cinema man let's go and now we can go ahead and try to buy an op unit oh wait i didn't even realize we just sold our shield camera man for 150 let's go oh wait this is good 486 for a Sinister Titan TV man. I might have to get this. Should I take it? Uh, I'm going to take it. Yep, there we go. I just bought it for 486 gems. Let's go. Finally, bro, we got a good unit. I also think we're going to need the speaker repair drone and the camera repair drone. But at the same time, I want a Cupid camera woman. Okay, I think this is a good purchase right here. Cupid camera woman for 80 gems. Purchase. There we go. The reason why I bought that is because the Cupid camera woman is actually lit, like the most overpowered early game unit in the game right now. Other than the green laser camera man, which obviously slows down the units. But you're going to have to use that in endgame as well. But the unit only costs 
costs 100 gems. I'm talking about the Cupid camera one, but it only costs 100 gems and it does piercing damage. And not only does it just do piercing damage, it does a bunch of damage with that. Like it literally starts off with 400 damage for 100 coins. That is absolutely crazy. Oh, camera Pedro in 125. No, he's in a trade. No, let me get that. Let me get that. That's mine. That's mine. That's mine. Yes, finally, we got one. Okay, so now our team can be the Cupid camera woman, the green laser cameraman, the sinister titan TV man, the camera repair drone, and the Santa TV man. But what I am thinking, we could replace the Cupid camera woman with the ghost cameraman, because I think the green laser cameraman is all right on his own, but we'll just stick with the sinister at the moment. So now we're going to go ahead and we're going to go ahead and do a nightmare run. Okay, yeah, with this Sinister Titan TV man, this nightmare run was super easy. And here we are on the giant smooth toilet. He's going to get absolutely taken out of here, bro. He's actually sped around this round and he's about to die. There we go. He's just about to die now. There we go. And he's dead. We've got 600 coins for that. So let me go back to the lobby and we're going to go ahead and spend them in the summoning. Yeah, long story short, we literally just got trash. Yep, and we just got trash. Okay, I think I'm going to go back to the trading plaza to see how much profit we can make. And as I said, by the end of this episode, we do want to an upgraded titan cinema man yeah guys we didn't end up selling anything from our marketplace okay guys it's pretty obvious we can't get to sell these guys so we are now on hour 75 which means we have 25 hours left of this challenge now what i'm gonna go do now i'm gonna go ahead and do an endless run so i'll see you there okay guys here we are in the saint patrick's day update i know we're an update later but there are some key factors of this update that we want to take advantage of so first thing the clovers now you might be wondering what I'm going to do with the clovers. So I can sell these St. Patrick Day crates for 50 gems each. And they're only 10 to buy. But at the same time, we have the most overpowered legendary unit in the game right here. The Leprechaun Cameraman. Now this unit literally solos Nightmare Mode. It will completely solo Nightmare Mode. No matter like how you do it, as long as you place them down, he's going to solo. He's absolutely crazy. So I might go to test out the new Toilet Fortress, but I do want to maximize the amount of clovers I have. So I'm going to go ahead and do one Toilet Fortress, and then I'm going to do a bunch of Nightmare, and I'm going to try to buy the Leprechaun Cameraman. Let's go. I think we're dead here. I left auto to uh, skip on for too long. There we go. But we did get 12 clovers, which is better than Nightmare, actually. And this only took 16 minutes. So we're going to test out something real quick. We're going to go ahead and buy a St. Patrick's crate, and we're going to see if we can resell it. Okay, here we go. Buy for 10 clovers. We're going to resell this thing hard. Oh, yeah, we can also sell our ghost cameraman because that guy is uh, useless, actually. Yeah, we can sell these guys for 50. Let's go. All right, 50 gems right here. Wait, how much can ghost go up for? All right, I'll put ghost up for 175. There we go. What's the cheapest, what's the cheapest leprechaun right now? 590? Oh, okay. I don't know. Maybe we should just straight up just go to buy the leprechaun cameraman. We could sit there and grind. Yeah, I think we should just grind for this leprechaun cameraman. Yep, I think we're dead again. Oh, rip. There we go. But we got 12 clovers again, and this only took us 15 minutes. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, guys, I started to try and make a macro, but like, um, yeah, I, I messed it up a little bit. So I think what we should do is do endless mode for a macro, but I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. Hmm, how do I do it? Oh, wait, just before we try to make a macro for endless mode, let me go ahead and hatch 10 over here. Here we are, and we got trash. But we're going to try to make a macro for the toilet fortress, so then we can do this overnight. And then we can maybe get that Leprechaun Cameraman and we can probably trade something with the Leprechaun Cameraman for an upgraded Titan Cinema Man. So let's get straight into it. Okay, so it looked like this actually did work overnight. So what I just did for my macro, I made it join endless and just place a Cupid camera woman exactly where I'm standing. And it looks like it actually worked, which is actually really good. But we have 7,550 coins and it's time for the big moment. Wait, let me turn my graphics up. It's time for the big moment to see how much clovers we actually got. Please tell me it was actually gr grinding clovers. Come on, 229. Yes. All right, yeah, we can buy the Leprechaun cameraman. That is mine, brother. That is mine, Leprechaun. Leprechaun cameraman. There we go. The most OP legendary in the game. I kind of want to open my coins, but I don't want to do it until the red laser cameraman's on there because the red laser cameraman is getting super overpriced right now. I am. We can claim some quests. So there we go. Easy 40 coins just like that. Now I'm debating if I should go over here to the St. Patrick's Day event and buy like 10 crates and sell them all on the marketplace. I don't know actually. Should I bro? I don't know if I should. I don't know bro. Wait, actually I want to buy a two times luck boost. 
boost. There we go. Because when I'm opening these coins, I'm going to need some luck. I'm going to need some luck. So mm, I'm actually debating, bro. Should I actually buy this again? Or should I buy one of these? Okay, I'm just going to buy another Leprechaun cameraman. There we go. And I'm just going to buy a St. Patrick's Day crate. There we go. I have two Leprechaun cameramen now. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the Leprechaun cameraman on the marketplace as long as, like, with my St. Patrick's Day crates. Okay. Okay, I'm going to take these off sale because uh, I don't need to sell my bat speaker men. This can go up for 50 and the leprechaun cameraman can go up for 550. There we go. And I'm also going to sell another one up here because I can always just AFK again and get another one. This is actually like a farm, bro. Oh, someone bought ghost cameraman. Oh, let's go. That's actually really good. Let's go. Yo, guys, we made some profit, but I don't know what I made profit on. I think it was my camera repair drone. Yeah, we, we sold our camera repair drone. I forgot how much we sold it for, but we still sold it. I think we got to find another um camera repair drone because them are they are pretty good. Oh, wait, guys, I might be wrong, but this is an insanely good price for a St. Patrick's Day crate. Okay, I'm going to buy the ones for 30 because um that is a very good price. Come on, someone buy it. Let me buy it, bro. Okay, I think that's just about I think that's just about enough. There we go. I'm gonna sell them all for 50 now. Oh wait, look, 29, bro. I'm getting these for so cheap. 30. This is easy gems that I'm making right now. Give me all of them. Yep, these are all mine. Okay, we got two people to buy our leprechaun craze. Okay, that's that's pretty good. So I'm gonna put some more on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, someone bought all of our crates. That's good. That's really good. Okay, 45. Oh, I nearly sold that for zero. And 45. Okay, we've only got two more to sell. Okay, they're all sold. We're nearly on a thousand gems now. That is actually pretty good. But we're still in need of a speaker repair drone or a camera repair drone. Let me go ahead and check if the summoning's changed. Because we want that red laser cameraman. Because that is getting overpriced right now. Okay, summoning did refresh. But we only have the shotgun cameraman in here. Which I don't think is going to cut it. But I do want to sell one of our leprechaun cameramen. Someone bought a leprechaun cameraman. Let's go. Uh, we actually just sold that for 350 that is pretty good in my opinion now i just want to sell these saint patrick's day crates and then we can go on to doing some runs okay so toilet tower defense came out with like a hunt update so what i think i'm gonna do because if i go to the hunt over here you can see the rewards i can get a lucky potion a coins potion and i can get both of them i guess but yeah i'm just gonna go around and speed run getting all these eggs because i already know where all of them are so one's up here one is here and I think the last one for the lobby is right here. There we go. They're all gotten ready. And I can get a lucky boost from that. That adds to, I think, already... Oh, wait. We have six lucky boosts. I thought we had, like, one, bro. I didn't know we had so much. Okay, let me go to the trading plaza and get the stuff in there. Okay, so I think I um need to spam man face man. Yeah, there we go. I got the man face egg. And I can go ahead and get this egg right here. And this one. And this egg over here. And I just need to trade someone. Come on, let me complete a trade. Uh, I'll give this guy a free dual bat speaker. Yes, there we go. We go and we should have the gold egg yes there we go and that's all of them for the trading plaza so we can claim a double coins boost there we go and the last one are just in rounds so we have desert and toilet city that we need to do let me do desert first and the egg should just be right around here unless they moved it for some reason where's the egg at oh wait it just spawns when the when the wave starts that's crazy all right lobby and now we can go to toilet city and we got a kit we got to kill 10 toilets and then we get an egg and then there's like a one in ten chance that we get some like other egg and then the last one's in endless mode okay yeah this egg just spawned right here there we go i just got the war egg for killing 10 toilets now i just need to wait to get the glitch egg come on give me this egg already bro we've done seven waves i haven't seen myself get the glitch egg yet even though i'm on wave 23 i think i'm just going to complete this round to just be sure that i've got the egg because it hasn't shown up for me yet. Okay, so we're on the giant smooth toilet right here. But our leprechaun cameramen are completely overpowered. So they should just take him out. There we go. So I'm going to go back to the lobby and see if we actually got that egg. Because I don't remember getting it. And let me go here. Did I get it? Yes, I did. Now the last egg is in Toilet Fortress. And it's in quite a high up spot. So I'll show you guys where to get it. So let me go over here to Toilet Fortress. There we go. So you just want to climb up this building right here until you get to this uh, little volcano over here. And you just jump up the volcano and the egg should be right at the top here. And I found the magma egg. So let me go back to the lobby and claim my rewards. Now, I don't know if this reward gives me like an extra two of these and the badge. I'm just going to have to check out. So um, I have six right now and five coins boost. Now, if I claim this, I... 11? Why did they give me so much? Dang, that is crazy. They gave me so much boost for that okay so i think i'm gonna go ahead and try to get this large laser cameraman right here with uh my boost on there we go now give me the large laser cameraman okay we got a laser cameraman car 
Another laser cameraman car. No way, we actually got it. No way. We got the laser cameraman. Bro, we got the large laser cameraman. Let's go. Let's see if we can get another uh, laser cameraman car. Bro, I'm happy with that mythic. Okay, another legendary. No way. There's no way we got two. Bro, that is crazy. We just summoned two mythics. Can we get a third? Can we get a third? I don't think we can. I don't think we can. There's like not a chance. That's already super lucky that we got two. Okay, now we can sell them on the marketplace. And we already have 1,120. 28 gems so i'm pretty sure we can buy some pretty expensive units after this how much do these guys usually sell for it seems like they only sell for like 200 but i'm still happy with that so i'm gonna sell one um for 200 and another one for 200 there we go wait i don't have enough space let me take one of these guys off and 200 okay so two of our saint patrick's day crates can't be on sale right now so i think i'm just gonna open them right here there we go come on give me the titan clover man and they did not give me the titan clover man that is a rip okay guys i think i'm gonna go ahead and do some toilet fortress right here because uh, i don't think i can sell my stuff okay here we are in toilet fortress this should be super easy because i think the leprechaun cameraman can literally solo auto skip until like wave 50 i'm telling you guys this thing is the most op unit in the game right now okay guys i think we're dead right here yeah we've got the soldier rocket toilet about to make it but we auto skipped this whole way and we were still able to make it to wave 52 with only the leprechaun cameraman which i think personally is kind of crazy yep there we go okay i think i'm gonna sit in the trading plaza and try to trade some of my units for gems on the marketplace obviously but i do want to get an upgraded titan cinema man which i think i could probably get with these gems wait guys we sold like everything we sold all our saint patrick's day crates i'm gonna put another one up for 45 right there but we actually sold one of our large laser cameramen which we just summoned that's actually really good but we are now on hour 87 of this challenge which means we've only got 13 hours left so hopefully we can get something good in then 13 hours I think now that I've sold stuff, I'm going to go ahead and try some nightmare mode to get some coins to summon a bunch of units. Okay, so okay, so here we are at the end of wave 50. And uh, this guy's getting absolutely taken out again. There we go. And he's dead. So we're going to retry that. We're just going to grind for a bunch of coins and then we're going to summon a bunch of units. Okay, guys, we're about to take down the mutant toilet again. Oh, the smooth toilet, sorry. And come on, the quad rocket mutant toilet get taken out. There we go. We're going to do another round and then we're going to like back up our boost. Okay, so this is going to be our last run right here. We've been doing this for two hours straight. There we go. Another 1,200 coins. So let me go back to the lobby. And if the red laser cameraman is on the summoning, I'm going to go ahead and spend all of my 8,400. Oh my God, he is. Yes. Okay. I'm going to equip a luck boost. Thank you very much. Come on, give me this. Give me this mythic. This is the one that I want. Titan TV man, that's all right. Trash. Titan TV man again. Trash. Come on, please give me this mythic, bro. Titan TV man. Trash. Titan TV man again. Come on, bro. Just give me the mythic at this point. Trash. Come on, give me the mythic, bro. Give me the mythic. No way I didn't get it. Okay, bro. Last try. No, we didn't even get it, bro. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, here we are, guys. In the Easter event. Easter event. Mech Bunny Titan. Bunny Crate. You, you already know the update. But obviously, there is a brand new Egg Island. So I think what I'm going to go do, I think I'm going to go do the Egg Island. Try to complete that. And then I'm going to spend the eggs that I get. And maybe we can even complete the battle pass. You never know. But let's get straight into it. Okay, guys, we got the rabid rabbit toilet right here. Um, okay, this guy has 11 million health. That is uh, quite a lot. This is definitely harder than nightmare mode because my leprechaun cameraman couldn't even solo. You know it's difficult when the leprechaun cameraman can't solo. I'm sorry, I've been glazing this unit recently, but like, it's actually so good. Come on, die already, bro. Die. You've got 2 million health left. You might as well just die now. Come on, bro. And the rabid rabbit, rab the rabid rabbit toilet is dead. There we go. I can't get my words out today. And we've got 800 coins for winning that and 250 gems with 2,000 XP. So let me go back to the lobby and hopefully we've got some uh, stuff on our battle pass. Okay, let me check the battle pass. Battle pass missions. Okay, there we go. Two missions. Destroy farm and toilets. Yep, yep. Okay, 100 eggs, coins, luck boost, coin boost, bunny crate, 20 gems. Okay, that's actually pretty good. I can buy another bunny crate as well. So I don't know if I should open these or not or sell them. Do I sell them? I don't know. I'm just going to open all my crates for now, except for like the St. Patrick's one because like I'm never getting anything good from that. Okay, we've got the large bunny man. That's we got two large bunny men. That's actually not even that bad. It's better than two, Um, I don't know what the 75 percent is but okay i think i'm gonna try to make a macro for this don't know how it would work though you know i'm just gonna have to go and find out 
Okay, update on the macro, guys. I think there's only two spawn points in this map because if I re... Oh, wait. Is this a new one? No, it's not. But they're all kind of similar. So there's like four spawn points here and four spawn points here, but they are kind of in the same spot. So I reckon if I start a macro to where I place a green laser and a leprechaun cameraman here and a leprechaun cameraman here, I could get pretty, pretty far in every single round that I do in the macro. So let me go ahead and record it. Okay, so basically we did like four and a half hours of this macro and it kind of bugged out a few times, but it ended up working at the end. Okay, guys, so we have 2,823 eggs and uh, we have uh, 8,000 coins, which is actually pretty good. So, all oh, my missions are my missions are done. Okay, that's that's good. That's good. That's good. Let's go. Now, it should be a little bit further in the event pass. There we go. Egg boost, coins boost, coins boost, bunny, bunny crate, gems. We've got a bunch of stuff here, bro. Oh, wait, we got the dual blade bunny man. Let's go. Bro, how many tiers did we get? Okay, there we go. We're on tw uh, tier 28. That's actually really good. Oh, and we got more quests. Oh my god. We're on tier 31. Okay, that is pretty crazy. So, with my uh, little uh, eggs, I think I'm going to go ahead and buy 10 of these guys and buy this and buy this. I kind of want to get the Mech Bunny Titan in this video. And we got nearly 10,000 coins. So, I think... Oh, restarting server. Never mind. But I think I'm going to hatch the coins first and then hatch the bunny crates. Okay, uh, let me use that luck boost. Actually, we've only got a few hours left. I might as well just use all my luck boosts and all my coins boosts. Okay, we got the red laser cameraman in here. That's good. That's good. Give me the red laser. Okay, we didn't get it. Trash, trash, trash. Actually, we got dual bat speaker, man. That's not bad. Okay, it doesn't look like I've got anything good here. So, I'm going to go ahead and open all of my bunny crates right here. Okay, 10. Please give me the mech bunny titan, bro. Give me it. Give me the mech bunny titan. No. Okay, large bunny man. I thought I got it, bro. That was kind of awful. Okay, open 10 again. I think, yeah, that's all of my crates. Come on, give me it, bro. Just give me it. It's not that hard. And no, we didn't get it. Oh, we got one more crate. Come on, give me it. Give me it. Trash. Okay, wait, how many egg boosts do I have? I can check in the event thingy. Okay, I have two. I think I might just grind a bunch of eggs. Yeah, I'm just going to grind a bunch of eggs. And I'll see you once we're done. And hopefully we'll be close to the end of the challenge. Okay, I've had a little glitch this game where I can't upgrade most of my units, uh, but I got Evan to fix it, so next round should be better. But we are about to take out the rabid rabbit toilet. Oh, wait, we might not even take him out. That's not good. Well, come on, take him out, bro. Two minutes he's stunned for. Bro, my guy's stunned for two minutes. There's no way a glitch is about to sell our round. Oh, my God, wait, our round's actually about to get sold from a glitch. That is annoying. Yeah, we're dead, bro. There's no way. We actually lost that round, but the glitch should be fixed next round, so we should be all good. Do I have a medic unit? Because I need to get one of them, bro. Not even, bro. I don't even have one. Okay, I think I'm just gonna keep grinding. Okay, there we go. We just killed the boss. So we're gonna go ahead and play again until all of our XP boost is gone. Okay, we're just about to take out the boss right here. Um, come on, rabbit, uh, rabbit, rabbit. There we go. I can never say that right. And there we go. He is dead. So I think I'm going to go back to the lobby because I think we got a few thousand eggs. Hopefully we did because I've been grinding for quite a while now. We have gotten 3,400 eggs. That is really good. Okay, and we got some missions done. So collect 5,000 eggs. Yup, complete winter mode, whatever it is, Easter mode. And we got some battle pass stuff. Oh, we got 10k coins. That's sick. All right, wait. There we go. We're just going to buy a bunch of bunny crates there we go and another two come on give me the mech titan this this time bro give me the mech titan come on bro give me oh no i didn't get it bro are you kidding me come on last few crates give me give me nope we got nothing bro okay i think i'm just gonna summon with my uh, coins right here come on give me something good give me a good unit trash okay spear speaker man we haven't gotten that yet and i think we just got trash bro are you kidding me okay i think i'm just gonna sell all my legendaries because we only got a few hours left on the challenge come on give me something good keep getting trash bro trash again okay two spear speaker men i think i'm just gonna sell them come on give me nah we got trash again bro i think i'm gonna sell my saint patrick's day crates as well okay saint patrick's day saint patrick's day I'm not going to sell them. I'm going to open them. No titans. I didn't expect to get a titan either way. Oh, wait. We can buy some clover crates right here. Yup. Let me buy all these. I don't think we got anything, bro. Are you kidding me? We got nothing again. Well, I can't really expect to get anything good, but I think I'm just going to keep on grinding until we get something good because we are on hour 97. We got three hours left. I might try to buy something for the trading plaza though. Yeah, I'm offering this guy 1.5 thousand gems for his upgraded titan cinema, man. He said, bro, add. Bro, this thing's only worth 1.5k. I can't add. I also bought a cupid camera woman for 100 25 gems that's good oh and we got a large laser oh my god so i just bought out all my stuff what no way all my stuff just got bought out by someone that is pretty crazy okay now what am i gonna do with these gems oh wait this guy's accepting wait let's go wait egg launcher cameraman for five i think that's good that's good right uh did it go through yes it went through okay egg launcher cameraman how many people okay 
It's selling for 700 on here. That's good. I think I got a good trade in. Okay, so I just went back to grinding for the tier 50 unit, which is the Titan Bunny Cameraman, which at the time of recording was worth a lot because it was brand new. Okay, so the rabid rabbit toilet is about to die and we are on our 99 right now. So let me go ahead and defeat this boss and come on, die already. There we go. And we're going to go back to the lobby and spend everything we have. And we're probably going to spend the last two hours trying to trade the upgraded Titan Cinema Man because that was our main goal of the episode, even though we've got more than enough to trade for it. But let's go to the Easter event. We've done some missions. Oh, I accidentally uh, accepted that trade request. I was not meant to accept that. And I'm going to claim that. And this. There we go. And we're on tier 48. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I might do a little bit more of uh, this event because then we can nearly get to the max level. Oh, we're so close. Okay. I'm just going to open one crate for a mission. There we go. That's another mission done. And we're at tier 48 right now. There we go. And we're going to buy some bunny crates. And I think I'm just going to hatch them all. Okay. Come on. Give me something. Give me something. Give me something. Give me something. Nothing, bro. I don't think I even got the mythic. Are you kidding me? No, I didn't even get the mythic. Okay, that is pretty awful, bro. But we can go ahead and try to get the upgraded Titan Cinema Man from the summon. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Oh, we got the Titan Cinema Man. Let's go. We got a mythic. I know it's like the, the cheapest mythic in the game, but still, we got a mythic. That's good. Okay, I think I'm just going to keep on doing rounds until I'm on tier 50. And then we could trade the tier 50 unit for quite a bit. And then after that, we could hopefully... Wait, how many of these guys even exist? Oh, I can't check. But then after that, we could hopefully get some pretty good units. So I'll see you then. Okay, we're about to take down the rabbit rabbit toilet. There we go. And if I go back to the lobby, hopefully I've uh, got to tier 50. Come on. Give me my tier 50. Okay, we, we done a we done a challenge apparently. Oh, no, we didn't. Oh, we got one more tier, bro. Four thousand XP left. Okay, I got five bunny crates from that, so I'm just gonna open all of them. There we go. Give me something good. I mean, I got a legendary. That's not that bad. Oh, I don't want to do another round of this, bro. Well, I have to do another two rounds actually. So let's get straight into it. Okay, there we go. We're finally tier 50 here we go the titan bunny man successfully claimed how many of these guys exist already 14k okay that is not a lot and we ended up getting it in only a few hours which is actually pretty crazy so i think what i want to go ahead and do is go to the trading plaza. actually let me spend my coins first but i'm gonna go to the trading plaza and try to trade this thing a bunch of gems and then we could try to get something like a chef tv or an engineer i reckon we could do that oh we got a large laser cameraman let's go that's another thing to add on to our trade list i guess Okay, so I'm going to say in the chat here, I'm going to say um, trading tier 50 Titan Bunny Cameraman for good offers only. I'm just going to put that in the chat. Okay, so we got someone offering an upgraded Titan Cinema Man for this thing. Uh, oh, I, he took it off and he uh, put some bad offer on there. So I'm going to go ahead and decline this. Okay, this guy said he was going to offer for it. So let's see what this guy offers. Titan Clock Man, Titan Drill Man, upgraded Titan Cameraman. Oh, I don't want to take that, bro. It's not worth it. I cannot take that offer, bro. Okay, I don't think it's very worth it, so I'm going to go ahead and decline this trade. Whoa, 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 whoa. This guy went and said, I don't like you for, for, for declining his trade. Okay, bro, that's a, that was, that, that's a little bit much, bro. Like, if you give me a bad offer, I'm going to decline it, bro. I can't just accept it. Wait, so I can't really sell these guys, but if I go ahead and uh, sell all of these for coins, then maybe I could uh, get something from the summoning. Now nah, we didn't really hatch anything. Rip. But we still do have 48 minutes left of this challenge, which means we have time to trade this thing. Oh, okay, wait. There's a partner in the game, and uh, he is selling some units. Wait, uh, I'm going to I'm gonna try to get my unit signed, actually. Okay, I've said to him, can you sign my Titan Bunny Cameraman Tier 50? It'd be goated if you could. Hopefully, uh, he would go ahead and sign my unit. I'm trying to be polite, so then hopefully he can, like, trade me or something. Oh, the partner sent us a trade request. Let's go. Okay. Can I say, uh, please sign? Okay, yeah, yeah. Hopefully he'll sign this. Please sign this, bro. Hopefully he trades us back. Yes, he traded us back. Please tell me he signed it. Yes, we got a signed unit. Let's go. Bro, shout out to this partner right here, Hydrox. Oh my God. Thank you so much, bro. Okay, so we actually got a signed unit right here. Let's go. Oh, wait. Someone's um, offering us the new godly. He said add, so I'm just going to add three mythic units right here. 
Good now, question mark. Ah, oh, he declined it, bro. Okay, guys, the 100 hours is up. We didn't end up trading our Titan Bunny cameraman, but only 14.4k of these guys exist, which means it is worth quite a lot. We have 2,000 gems in our inventory, which is also worth a lot. And yeah, we have a bunch of stuff right now. And I'm pretty happy for the progress in this video. But obviously, if you guys made it to the end of this video, make sure to like and subscribe because we literally just played this game for 100 hours, which is an absolutely crazy amount of time to play this game for. And we made a bunch of profit. And obviously, you enjoyed this video if you watched the whole way to the end. So make sure to hit that subscribe button and get this video to 10,000 likes if you want me to do 125 hours. So I'll see you guys in the next one.